All right, guys, I was going to make this video tomorrow, but I think it's actually worth talking about uh, today. Uh, a couple people have brought this to my attention. Um, right now, there's an interesting situation going on in the EU. Um, potential, as you could see, the metals are already starting because the market is open. The metals are already starting to rise. We already see a 35 cent increase in silver, over $16 in gold. The reason for that is, is there's a bank run going on in Cyprus and in Greece. Basically, what's going on from what I understand is, and you could thank your governments, and this goes to show, I've talked about so many times about how variables can change things in an instant, where the government, to try and uh, manage their debts for the bailouts, and it shows how governments are, they're not loyal to the people, they can say whatever they want and promise you everything, but actions speak louder than words, took about, I think it's like 6.6% .6 out of everybody's bank account. If you made under a hundred thousand and anything over a hundred thousand, they took nine point nine percent. Now I might be a little off on the specific numbers, but that's not the point. The point of the matter is is the government took people's personal accounts and took their money out without their permission. And now people are trying to get any amount of money they can out of the banks. So this is really gonna start causing a potential panic. And you know, especially in the United States of America Corporation, I can almost guarantee that the media will either not talk about this at all or talk about it so minimal no one will even recognize it and pay attention to it. So this is information we need to get out there. So right now we see silver is already up, and the market's only been open for 17 minutes. Silver is now at 29.14, up 38 cents. Gold is at 16.08, up $16. Um, it's actually past platinum again because platinum right now is at 1598, but it's up 10. And right now, palladium's up at 780 dollars. Now, less than a month ago, or approximately a month ago, I was telling people how palladium was a good buy, and I actually showed that one ounce palladium bar that I bought, and that was when palladium was at 696. So we're seeing a nice run here. So um, we were talking about a potential dip. And then all of a sudden, something like this comes up, and it can change things in an instant. So this is what I want people to know, and this is where actions speak louder than words. You can hear so many people talk about things like gold and silver, and they say how no one's going to go to it, and it's going to fall down to nothing, and it's going to be this, and it's going to be that. What this shows time and time again, when people have any kind of problem with their money, the thing that they do is almost immediately go to precious metals. So I don't know what other way to explain to people that that is your best way to protect yourself. So people want to check into this. You can just Google search um, Cyprus bank runs, and you can see it for yourself. There's so many of them, there's no sense of even checking a link. You can even do that here on YouTube. So we're going to stay tuned on this, but I want you guys to know this is one of the reasons why I've talked so much about being patient, paying attention to what's going on, and don't let the lulls shock you. Because, yes, they were potentially talking about dips, and they still might come, but it, all, it always shows that something that you're not expecting to happen could happen and totally change things around. So for those people who sold their positions in gold and silver, I wonder if they're going to be worried about the fact that they can ever get it again for the amount that they sold it for. So that's why I always say, guys, be careful. Don't be greedy. Don't base things on money, and definitely don't base things on emotion. So I'm going to keep this video very short today. Uh, if you haven't seen my video I made before, please watch it. It's my honest review about Bitcoins. I want people to see that I will be honest to the best of my ability to describe things. So everybody works out to be fine because we all need to work together. Because as you see, as these governments do, they can say whatever they want and patronize us by telling us they actually care about us. But when it comes to their messes, they steal our money to clean it up. If you want to continue to do that, then let's keep fighting amongst ourselves and get nothing done, or we could finally realize it's time to stop putting up with their bullshit. We the people, and that means everybody. All right, guys, thanks a lot for watching. Peace.